Hey guys, it's JC's Reborn Journey here. So I am here just really quickly to show you like what I'm up to right now. So what I'm going to be trying to do is take this pole down, put a new one up, and then put the shower curtain, and then the shower, that shower curtain up. So that one is definitely mine. I wanted to keep it. We bought that down in North Carolina and it will remind me of Dennis. So I would like to have some stuff that does remind me of him. Make me feel good because we bought it together. Um, so yeah, it's uh, kind of homey, I think. I mean, eventually, if I wanted to get something different, I will. But for right now, it's a shower curtain. I might as well use it. Um, and that's really it. So I'll show you what it looks like after. Hey guys, so really quickly, I wanted to just show you. I took it down, and I put in the new bracket piece up. Um, what I had to do was use this right here. This is a special drill bit. Uh, for cement but it's going through this so I'm really happy that I did that so I'm going to do that to this side and then I'm going to start putting the thing up so I just wanted to show you really quickly that I did that part so now I'm going to do the next part alright guys so I just want to show you what it looks like done so this is what it looks like done and then I'm going to just put the uh, thing on and then I can go to the next project okay guys so now it is completed so I think this took me under an hour to do. Um, I wasn't really paying attention to the time, but it, it was really not that hard. And it was easier than the first time I did it because obviously the first time you're trying to figure out how to do it, so now I knew how to do it. And it also helped because there was already uh, like holes in the wall, so I started with that one and then I drilled the rest of them. So I'm really glad I got that special um, cement bit because it went through. So let me show you the inside of it. And I think for the most part, what do you guys think? I think that these colors right here match a little bit of the yellow, right? What do you think? Like it doesn't look that bad, I guess. And uh, so let me show you what it looks like on the inside. So here we are pretending to take a shower and I have so much more room now. Like look at my hand, you know, it's just a lot more room in here because it comes out so I recommend this for anybody who has a bathroom that can actually utilize this some places like we had something in the way of the um, in the trailer so we weren't able to put this up but we always wanted one and once we left we were just like that's it we're getting one we got it we're using it we loved it we still love it and it just makes you, especially if you're claustrophobic, it just makes this a lot easier. So, I put these pockets on the inside this time. Um, I really wasn't using them on the outside. I put a couple of things, you know, in there for Dennis, but other than that, I really didn't use it myself. So, what I would like to do is utilize it the best I can. So, I'm hoping, you know, you gotta keep in mind how much weight could this really thing, could this thing actually hold. So. Um, I figured, you know, I'd put this in there and any, um, you know, soap or something that I would use and then maybe have like one pocket for like company or something, but I don't, I'm not really planning on having any company, so, but it would still be nice to just have something in case something happens and you're like, oh, hey, here's some company and I didn't know, but, um, I don't want to like store stuff in here unless I absolutely had to. Um, I'm actually going to try and downsize a little bit, especially with the soap because I don't use that much myself. I just like collecting soap for some reason. So, um, and then I'll have to show you the thing on the behind the door now because that looks pretty good. So I'll show you that and uh, come follow me into the next project. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe. Thanks guys.